Fans of the 611 locomotive had their chance to pay respects to the Queen of Steam today at the Blow the Whistle event held at Roanoke's Transportation Museum, and it signals its arrival back home. As 10 News reporter Amy Cockerham found out, the fond memories it brings spans generations. That's a sound steam locomotive fans have been waiting for. Oh, I'm a little kid in the candy store. I mean, this has been a dream of mine since a little kid. The Ugron family from the Roanoke Lynchburg area are among many that came to see the over 70 year old locomotive. Pull the cord to blow the whistle is just something else. That's Jeff, Ray, and Joey, three generations of locomotive lovers. Perfect timing. It was kind of something different, something for Father's Day. Yeah. So it was kind of one of those unique experiences where, you know, a gift card couldn't change it, a cash couldn't change it, you know, card couldn't change it. Something that we may not get to experience together again. It's been more than four years since the Queen of Steam was in the Star City. It spent time on display in Pennsylvania, but there's no better place than home. Roto built. Built here, bred here, ran around here. Always a piece of the Roanoke history. It's something that we'll never forget. Thank you. In Roanoke, Amy Cockrum, 10 News, working for you. And people at the Virginia Museum of Transportation say there may be something else exciting in the works. The 611 Steam Excursions may be coming back to Virginia. Well, no dates have been set yet. Officials expect them to take place later this year.